Team Red are attempting a quick Gold Fury. The only possible response can be from Auxilla and Pulse 99. There is no complete round table for their discussions. If they have a plan, it's just the two of them. They could make it if they try. Auxilla ascends into the air. Pulse travels by land for Skulls and Glory. Sends it into the pack. Shadow locks Little Dev and Cupid. Makes it easy for Auxilla to hit the hovering Dev. Cupid has to grate his face against Tectonic Rift. The Spirit Ball goes far, far away. The taunt finally draws Auxilla's attention. Pulse at the back there, cutting off Cupid. Isis steps in and blocks the attack for Cupid with the wing. None of this is enough. Auxilla is just so fast with the buff killer side. Pulse draws Athena's attention. And Auxilla getting mightily locked down, creeping curse, sorry times to set of death side. Isis eliminated! As a foreign of death side for the soul reap, Osiris shows its carcass of how much killing power does Auxilla have left? He's hiding behind the gold fury they denied earlier. The temple holds him in place, but not for long enough. They aggro the gold fury. Agent Apollo has arrived in style! Yes, bring more back up! Oh, it looks so good! Nice driving strike! Another death side, only Osiris's remains remain in play. Zero chance he can escape this one and whilst they take him out of the game they also work towards acquiring that gold fury this one's a weekly tanky one <laughs> planted Middle lane going assassin save circuit initiates until that's Loki counter assassins. Good shield circuit jumps out, get blinks in for the free man cataclysm. No circuit uses beat, but can't escape the damage from assassinating. Thor is here, taking on backers. Get rolls in and shuts dark dodo before he can portal through the wall. It's a mere inconvenience. Backus gets a jump on Loki, intoxicate sensation, a blasphemous burp, Dark Dodo's green mean energy beam, vaporizing up a triple kill. All that's left is Gavin. Well, that's one hell of a chase. We'll leave it at that. Join us for a battle of the Dole Fury. A lot of abilities firing. But who will be the first team to fully commit to a fight? It's so bad with the Sonic Pick on Loic. Cupid uses Beard of Love, tries to stare him, but it wasn't said that Loic moves into Blue Team and moves around the jungle. Yana's chasers. Meanwhile, Valona sustaining heavy damage to the Darkest of Night activated. Mitchell just now begins his contribution to the fight. Now that C Deck is here. It's three on four. Loic strikes Yanis before he gets through the portal. C Deck releases the bag of demons. Mitchell and C Deck trying to be in the way of any harmful projectile. C Deck takes the hard bomb and moves away to avoid splash damage. Mitchell's wall allowing Loic to kill Servo, but he's fatally low on health. C Deck back in exposes the evil within Cuban. What a mess that just got cleaned up. Isis is in a rush back to middle tower. In her path, Athena, the Tom meets Bjorn Cage meets Capri, obsessed with Isis. He waits out the white glowing aura and pitches her. That's a heartbreaker. Sandetta gives it his all. A big hand please for Mariah Carey. These two belong together. It's left the crowd speechless. What a fantastic performance. I do hope she'll join us again next year, perhaps on a different card. Wow, I can't believe it. Mariah Carey me to victory. and Liddy 4 are getting surrounded unbeknownst to them. GTM fights the rear for Ram and Mercury. Freeze on Ram. Purifies it, rolls out, but keeps focusing shots on Anna and clear to find target. Rodriguez getting his right of Wolfsman. Rama's face. Mega Ultra Hyper Spin X. The flame sticks have been thrown the wrong direction. Shards of Fury and an impale on Mercury ain't surviving that. Thor's been here for a while. Tries to lock in Rama, goes with Astral Barrage. Uderick is keeping on his toes. Liddy for the Glacial Strike. This time Rama rolls forward. Uderick's in close quarter danger. Move towards the least sharp turns. It's a squeeze to Fred through the Amir and the Pillar. But they've managed to hit the wall, limiting Rama's mobility. Kronos struggling to provide the damage. This Rama's staying alive for a long time. Enters the tower. <laughs> Ruderikas claims the kill! Have some pride in that play!